race, the second leg of the Firethorn Equine Services Pacing Series for two-year-old Colts and Goldings. Racing one mile, a purse of $3,000. Number one, first half of the entry is Sando Hoy. Home of Bill Sanders of Atlanta, Georgia, Tyloid Drops. 1A is Santana, Oba Bill Sanders of Atlanta, Georgia, with Brad Handers. They'll be scoring from post position number nine. Number two is George's View, owned by Tony and Vando Betty of Ohio, Mike Wilder. Up. Three is one of 11, owned by Dennis Owens and Glenn Huber of Ohio, with Dave Miller. Four is Mercer Lane Sam, owned by Magic Touch and Mercer Lane Farms of Georgia and Ohio, Eric Lenford. Up. Five is Steelheart, told by O.A. Brightenbaugh Huber and the DTP Standardbreds of Ohio and Florida. Dick Richardson, Jr. driving. Number six, My Log Hill, told by Dan Wiseman of Fort Lauderdale, Mel Turcotta. Seven is Direct Express, sold by Louis Boslo and Jane Cummins with John Cashman III. Eight is Scoot and Newton, told by Lloyd Voiles and Tom Christie, Jeff Fowd on the bike. At the number nine horse, from post position number 10, is Sungate Casanova, with Fanny Wiley of Pinehurst, North Carolina, Roger Culliford in the sulky. When play show, perfected trifecta wagering. Five minutes to post time, five minutes. Two-year-old pacing, Colts and Gildings, moving in behind the gate. They swing to the back stretch, and there they go. They're off, and it's Mercer Lane Sam. First to fire for the lead, but from the outside, here comes My Law Kill from the inside to second. It's George's view. Into the first turn they go, and here comes Steelheart into the picture early. From the inside five, it's Sand Ahoy. Along the rail, racing is sixth. It's one of 11. Two lengths, racing seventh, Sungate Casanova. Another two to Direct Express. Ninth is Sam Teller, and off the back end, here comes Scoot Newton at the first quarter, 28 and 1. Steelheart with the lead here, leads by two. Mercer Lane, Sam with the inside, is racing second. On the rail, third, it's George's view. Two lengths, fourth, the mile long hill, looking to flush that cover, and five comes Sand Ahoy. Saving ground up the rail, sixth. Comes one of 11 to the outside, a seventh as they approach the half, it's Sungate Casanova. Off the rail, it's Santowner. Reaching the half, 58 and three by the lead. It's Steelheart, Jake LaBelle Colt leading by three parts of a length. Ranging up on the outside, pressuring the leader. Here comes George's view. Along the rail, locked in Mercer Lane, Sam. My long kill, getting the perfect trip. Second of her gapping fourth. Inside to five, one of 11 to the outside of sixth, it's Sandahoy. Down the back stretch they go. Tyrell Colts and Gillings beginning to tighten up now. With a lead, it's still Steelheart. Leading by three parts of a length. On the inside, racing as second as George's view. Three quarters, 128. Here comes my long hill. And my long hill looming up on the outside. Sungate Casanova swinging far. As they turn for home, they've lost it an eighth of a mile ago. And down the stretch they come. My long hill takes that lead away. It's Sandahoy between horses. Down to the inside, Steel Hart. Far outside, it's Sungate Casanova tight battle here for place and show but it's all my log hill in record time 157 and 4 here's the official winner second lag of the Farth Thorn equine services pacing series number six my log hill a talented son of log from Maddie Hill by Falcon Elmerhurst Oh, then trained by Dan Wiseman of Fort Lauderdale, Florida. Mel Turk out of the Sulky. My Long Hill, his second lifetime win. He's two of two in the late closing series. Facing tonight's mile 157 and four.